deep breaths. Poppy, Poppy, Poppy! Oh, hey! Hey, homie! Come here, come here, come here! You know what? If you thought it was incredible getting a shot of that aging trout the other day, you just wait till we get a picture of Poppy Mitchell getting in a dirt box, man. Beverly, good to see you. No, seriously, dude. Dude, it is a backdoor bonanza with that bitch's concerned. Ah! America's newest sweetheart. Man, she likes cotton candy and puff. Yeah, ain't getting in the bunghole. Wow. No, no, seriously, dude. One shot of that dirty little slut monkey, and we're in the money, homie. We're in the money. Uh. And who says America is going to hell? Well, not me. I. <laughs> Come on, let's move. Now, remember, dude, this is a covert op. We need to blend in ninja style. Follow my lead, confident but forgettable. From here on out, we're ghosts. Yeah, me and you, we ain't gonna stand out. At all. Shh, you blow our cover. This should be fucking interesting. Someone, stay close and play it cool. What do you want me to do? I'm at work. Just change this diaper. It's not that hard. I don't care if it smells like number two. It's your grandpa. That's what family do. Listen, I gotta go. Love you. Do your homework, okay? Hey, Maria. How are it going? You know, another day, another minimum wage. You see the state of Bungalow dress? No, what's it bad? Come on. They should be just past this pool. Right around this corner. Are you ready to see America's sweetheart getting it in the sweet meat room? Here, you take the camera. She knows me, dude. I'll keep lookout. Is that good, babe? Oh, oh, it's fantastic. Really? Yes. I must say, for a virgin, you're really not that into this. I'm only a virgin for TV. Really? I mean, I always wash afterwards and jump up and down, so it doesn't count. What? I'm not releasing a sex tape for at least three years. Unless my agent tells me to. What? I thought this... I love you, Poppy. I really want us to go places. I thought we could be the cutest teen couple. But, Justin, you're 21 and I'm 24. We only say we're teens for marketing purposes. That's not true. Okay. Just get on with it, will you? I'm hungry. There's someone watching. Oh, shit. Security. Creepy. Abort. Creepy. Abort. Creepy. This way. You're fucking dead. Come on. Us. Go, go, go. How the fuck did this happen? Get your ass in the car now. The show coming after us! Well, don't just sit there! Film that psycho slut! Damn! America's sweetheart is one angry ass bitch! <laughs> yeah, I know! She's terrifying! It's perfect! I'll try to lose them! I was working on my quad, you idiot! Straight road coming up! This is your chance to get a good shot of her! Man, you're not the one hanging out this fucking trunk! You people are stuck! Man, it's gonna get worse before it get better! Whoa, whoa! What the hell, man? That motherfucker's right on top of us, dawg! I'm taking a sharp right! Keep that camera on her! Those two men are child molesters! I'm gonna go left and cut across the intersection! Hold on! We need her face, man! Don't let me down! You have no idea what I'm capable of! Move! Come on, man! Hit the gas! This crazy-ass bitch! Stay on her! Ah, oh, shit! We got traffic ahead! Going left! Keep it steady! I will fucking destroy you! And everyone who knows you! Jesus, she's still on us! 
Screw this! I'm going through the construction site! No! Man, shit! I hope this didn't just turn into a snuff movie. Eh, whatever. She's fine. I'll wipe the audio. Oh, I can just see the headlines now. Poppy Mitchell crashes car on drug-fueled sex rampage. Another illuminating experience, homie. Hey, well, someone's got to do it. I really don't think so. Hey, look, if you don't want to become rich beyond your wildest dreams while performing a vital public service, you won't meet me again. But then again, you're not an idiot. No, I am a fucking idiot. Do you ever clean your raggedy bitch ass up? Fuck you, Lamar. I mean, Franklin or whatever. Everybody on the block knows you gone on vine wood and shit. Well, shit, if going vine wood means I ain't hitting the pipe like 1992, then shit, I'm guilty as charged. Punk ass. What? Bitch ass. Excuse me? <laughs> Look. I'm sorry, but where's your love for the hood? JB ain't doing good. He needs help. We need your help, nigga. We gonna lose everything. All right. Shit. What do I gotta do? Same as before, boo. A little help with the tow truck. Nothing for a real man like you. All right. You just get yourself together. Your ass done went crazy. So where you parked? You never could say no to me, Franklin Clinton. I ain't so cracked out I don't remember that night behind the burger shot. Not this again. What, we was like 13? But you was a man after that night. Damn, every time with this shit. And nothing even happened. It's all good, baby. I know that wound ain't healed. truck, you know the drill. <laughs> yeah, we got you. JB still sick. Man, you sure you need me? Because you look like you know what you're doing. One, I can't drive. And two, this ain't no work for a lady. Oh, you really fighting the feminist cause there, ain't you, Tanya? Like your aunt, you mean? I saw her fake jogging the other day, chanting some whacked out nonsense. That bitch is crazy. Yeah, that we can not agree on. Yeah, that we can't agree on. And I got qualifications, honey. Like hell you do. I got a certificate in cosmology. You never see my nails. <laughs> what, you going into space now? You always did think you were so clever. Remember Davis High? You didn't learn shit at that school. <laughs> and you got your math on the corner in Davis.
We're on, boo. Let's move it out. Come on. I was only parked there for a minute. This ain't a job for making new friends, is it? I thought you been into some repo work. Yeah, that's true. Same shit, but nicer cars. It's an honest dollar, and there ain't many of those around. An honest dollar that I ain't seen yet? Man, JB need to get his head straight. JB's going through a hard time. A hard time sitting on his ass smoking crack? I gotta keep his hours up. Word is they gonna sell the business. A new owner ain't good news for the drivers with no papers. JB sold his social for a piece two years back. I see the problem, but I just don't see that as mine. You too good to cover a brother now? I'm here, ain't I? I've been covering that brother for 20 years. Drop it in the marked area. Same as before, honey. I'll make it up to you, Franklin. You know I will. See you round. Not an FIB agent. You don't get to know where I am all day. Jesus. I am tired of your bullshit, Michael. Tired.
the hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Okay, listen. What do you got? The Holy Grail. The Union Depository. Now, they say it cannot be hit. It hasn't been yet. Look, I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks as I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martin Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. Oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Oh, well, gem as it is, then. Let's go to Vangelico, buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those Irish crazies, they mostly just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was uh, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City, but nah, he went quiet. All right. Well, we're gonna need a crew. You got any contacts in LS or not? I've been working with someone, but they're too unpredictable. I'll have to reach out to some other guys. The shop's on Little Portola. Your FIB buddies, they uh, know you're back in business. FIB buddies? What are you talking about? I checked out the WPP thing. Doesn't look like any WITSEC program I'm aware of. But for starters, they, uh, they don't put witnesses up in multi-million dollar mansions in Rockford Hills. Oh, maybe they thought this would be the best cover. And most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums into a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdrawals, the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except for one incident, the shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Michael Town. Yeah, 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 all right. Lester, I'm very impressed. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. Now take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm gonna run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need. Here we are. Sir, thank you. The alarm keypad is on the left when you come in, uh, on the wall by the side door. Glasses are live, shoot away. Ah, okay, that's their alarm. Uh, can you get me an air vent in one of the cameras? Great, you got the security camera and the ventilation in that shot. Good work, now speak to the assistant and see if there's anything else we need to know. Hey, beautiful. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. Well, one of them. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. This ain't my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe 10 grand. Our rings start at 8. Our pendants start at 12. All right. So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> No, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels. 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm going to take a look around. Think about it. Come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Come back to me. So, we good? Almost. I need to get eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation comes out.
Drive us around the block. We gotta find a way up to the roof. Gutting the place, I might be able to get to the roof. So, you keep up with the old crew? Well, after your death slash disappearance, there wasn't much holding us together. Yeah. You see him at all? After the incident? I kept tabs on him for a while, needed to uh, know that he didn't blame me. I saw a ladder. Climb up it and see if you can get to the roof. Yeah, where'd he go? North, south, east, west, wherever there were liquor stores to turn over and hitchhikers to disappear. Where did they bury him? They buried him? Not as far as I know. He's probably a John Doe then, right? What do you think? OD? Shootout? Maybe just a car crash, right? I'm on the roof! I need to know where the air coming out of those vents in Vangelico originates. There should be a unit above the store. Anonymous charred remains on the highway. They only knew what a sick puppy they had on their hands. Hey, I see the vents. Yeah, I'm looking at the relay. Can you get any higher? I've pulled up a satellite image. It looks like the highest point is on the northwest side. Get a shot from there. Let's speed this up. We don't want to draw attention. <clears throat> Here, take your glasses back. Let's go back to the garment factory. I called ahead and told them to start setting up the information. What did you see? Nothing that'll cause undue complications. Yeah, it looked like a simple setup. Cameras broadcasting to a remote server. We might be able to wipe them remotely. Security guard on the door. He won't want to dive through the chassis and rub his nose in it. Good. An alarm system linked to the door lock. We'll get a good window so when talented hacks it. Anything else? Well, the uh, more valuable merchandise is in the cabinets in the center of the store, by the register. So I'd start there. The glass in the cabinets wasn't bulletproof, it means you can smash them easy enough, but the stones will be in the safe at night. So, we go in when it's open then. Right. Once we melt down the gold, recut the rocks, that's an okay score. Yeah, shame we can't go in after hours, man. Those vents look promising. We might be able to flip that another way. I'm listening. Wait till we get back. About the crew. Yeah? There's this kid who's been helping me. Maybe we could cut him in. I don't work with amateurs. He ain't an amateur. Or if he is, he's a gifted amateur about to turn pro. He's a good kid, Lester. You know what they say. It's your funeral. One of them, at least. Ha <laughs> ha. The photo. 
Uh, workers have their uses. Okay, let me set this up. <laughs> nice to see the methods haven't changed. Well, we gotta figure out what we're doing somehow. All the crews, the roles, prep work. Don't want to leave evidence behind on a hard drive. So yeah, the uh, methods don't change. Right, not for a pro. <laughs> well, mapping out the options, uh, showing you all the angles, that's my area of professional expertise. But making decisions, that is your domain, my friend. Here. And there's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knockout gas through the air system, then hit the cabinets while everyone's out. You'll have to source the gas, of course, but crowd control won't slow you down, and that might improve the take. The cover is pest control, so no one will look twice when you're wearing gas masks. It means getting a pest control van, though. You go in dumb, and you'll need your, uh, famous way with people and four carbine rifles. But we can't buy them and risk them getting traced. No, 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 we've got to find some in circulation. It's awkward, it's, uh, <laughs> real awkward, but this is the gun favored by LSP. PD tactical team, so one of their vans is probably a good place to look. A hacker can disable the cameras. The length of time depends on their ability. The alarm will be operating on the same window. The exit strategy is more or less the same for both options. The driver you pick will, of course, source some bikes. You come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the Del Perro freeway. You lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the LS River. All right, I want my guy Franklin on the getaway. He can handle a bike. All right, if you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. So how do you want to do this? Run in through the front door or try to play it smart? Ah, still a hothead? Well, some things never change. Select personnel with that in mind. As ever, the better they are, the bigger the cut. Now the driver, they'll source the bikes, lead you out through the tunnels. Eddie Toe. Now you can count on him to get you out of a spot. Guns. Yeah, it might be hot and heavy in there. This guy, I'll keep it from going bad. Gus Moda. Yeah, he's a pro. Not much else to say. Hacker. Back office, but this is the person who will determine how long you get inside. Harris. <laughs> Good. Feminine touch. She'll be able to find any back doors they got. That look good to you? Are you sure? Okay, uh, I'll look into how you can find a tack team and get their weapons, and I'll be in touch. Oh, yes. Huh? Good, good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa, what? My rep don't count for nothing no more? You're a dead man, Michael. I'll call you. 